Forests are the second largest land use in the country after agriculture, and about 300 million population is depending on the forests for their livelihood, fuel woods, fodders, non-timber forest products, and various ecosystem services. Forest and climate change are directly linked to each other, and forests play a significant role in mitigating the climate change. Forests are considered to provide a large climate change mitigation opportunity at relatively lower costs along with other significant co-benefits. Forests are known as the sink as well as the source of carbon. Role of forests has been increasingly recognized as cost-effective option for climate change mitigation through carbon capture and storage in the biomass and in the soil. Indian Council of Forestry Research and Education ICFRE, along with Madhya Pradesh and Chhattisgarh State Forest Departments, are implementing the World Bank-funded Ecosystem Services Improvement Project ECIP. This project is supporting the goals of Green India Mission by demonstrating models for adaptation-based mitigation through sustainable land and ecosystem management. ICFRE is implementing the subcomponent on forest carbon stocks, measuring, monitoring and capacity building of ESIP. Main objective of this subcomponent is to develop, test and pilot systems for measuring and monitoring forest carbon stocks and to build the capacity of state forest departments for measurement and monitoring of carbon stocks. The resource manual and brochures on measurement of forest carbon stocks have been developed by ICFRE for capacity building of the state forest departments and joint forest management committees. The resource manual covers all aspects of carbon assessment right from determining the sample size, laying out sample plots, measuring various variables, and finally analysis of different carbon pools in a forest ecosystem. ICFRE is building the capacity of the state forest departments of Madhya Pradesh and joint forest management committees for measurement of forest carbon stocks and organized several trainings for the state forest departments and joint forest management committees of Madhya Pradesh and Chhattisgarh. Forest carbon stocks measurement in India is being done through conducting field-based surveys by laying out of the sample plots and using satellite-based remote sensing technologies. The purpose of carbon measurement in forests is to estimate plot-level forest carbon stocks at above-ground and below-ground carbon pools and develop a comprehensive picture of carbon stocks at project, regional or country level. In recent years, eddy covariance technique has emerged as promising technique to measure net carbon dioxide ecosystem exchange of carbon dioxide at daily, monthly, and yearly time scales. Increasing number of eddy covariance-based carbon flux towers provide the best opportunity for estimating gross primary productivity of different forest types. ICFRE has established two carbon flux towers in the Khatpura Beat, Budhni Forest Range, Sehore Forest Division of Madhya Pradesh, and in Sonhat Beat, Raghunathnagar Forest Range, Balrampur Forest Division of Chhattisgarh for measuring the carbon fluxes of forests. Training programs on measurements of carbon through carbon flux towers were organized to introduce this new technology to the forest departments as well as to the scientists of research organizations. Regular monitoring of carbon exchange particularly over forest ecosystems, is a key to climate policy making decision due to large carbon sequestration potential of the forest ecosystems.